So let's keep going, see what else we can find. I knew there's gotta be more here. We've got Civil War, we've got old coins, and um, we haven't even hit the back of the house yet, so there's more here, I just know it. You. <laughs> Right. Well, Drew and I are out in Maryland today. We just got this killer permission. We decided to go door knocking. We got a phone number. We called the phone number and we got the permission. Score. Score. Um, so we're gonna do a little bit of digging today. Um, really, really old property, probably early 1800s. Uh, hopefully we get on some good stuff today, but it's gonna be good. Today's gonna be a good day. I've got a feeling. So. Today's the day. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, so our first hit out of the yard right along the front sidewalk is a buffalo nickel. Check it out. Not bad for our first signal. Shiny. No way, really? What is it? 36 Merc. All right, well, it looks like we've got a pin or a piece of jewelry, maybe. Oopsies. Still got the piece on the back. So I'm gonna go with a pin of some sort. Piece of jewelry. I don't know, a brooch. Pretty cute. It's not silver though. We're looking for silver. Today we have to beat Andrew and he's already got a Merc. Let's keep going. We have got a possible lead weight. Maybe? I think mean, that's what it is. Definitely lead. Definitely old. It's got that white patina on it. I don't see anything on it though. Yeah, let's stick it in the pouch and keep going. So Andrew just pretty. found something else. What did you get, Andrew? I think I have to clean it up, but I'm pretty sure it's a small cradle. Buckle. I've got a stinking Lincoln and two Mercs so far. Okay, well, we moved off into the corner of the yard. I just got a really shallow signal, and it was really loud, and I'm kind of surprised by what it is. I'm going to show you um, real quick. I just got a spoon. Check out the fancy on that. I'm actually really surprised by how shallow that was. That was that was right there. Look at that. That's fancy too. Yikes. Guess we're gonna be digging some of those shallow tones. Very fancy. Alright, let's keep going. Alright, well I I think I just got a Civil War artifact, which is kind of super exciting. <laughs> I was thinking when I looked at this house that it dated probably around the 1850s to 1860s. Um, but, check this out, it's kind of cool. Yeah, so there would have been a triangle, and this would have clipped into the triangle. That would have been part of a backpack. Sweet. Heck yeah. I love it. Ta-da! Didn't look like it was very deep either. It wasn't very deep. Yeah, none of the stuff I've been getting has been very deep. I just dug a spoon bowl at like two inches. Nice. Yeah. Right about where you're sitting here, mm -hmm. I got the top of the uh, lantern guts. Nice. All right, let's keep going. Well, it looks like I got dirt in my face already. Um, it looks like we may have just gotten a fatty Indian. I thought at first it was just a regular penny, but it's a little bit thicker. So, let's check it out together and see what it is. Put the tripod down here. I think these Indian head pennies are a little bit more exciting than those Netherland Indian head pennies, am I right? Of course, I don't have a brush. Mm, I don't think we're gonna take it off, but it's definitely a fatty. Definitely a fatty. Darn it. I get by from Europe, but I'm so not prepared. Fatty. Yeah. Yeah, oh, I got 
but it's 8.57. 57. Pretty toasted, but I'll take it. It's my first old coin since getting back from Europe, and I will absolutely take that. I was in Europe for too long. Oh my gosh. That's Andrew flying, just yeah. says, it's 57, it's a flying eagle. And I'm like, oh my god, you're right. It's flying eagle. Yep, it's definitely it's not a fatty. It's a flying eagle. I got that's a flying even, eagle. That's even better. That's even better. That's even better. <laughs> yes. Job, All right. Baby. No fist bump. Your hands are dirty. I don't want your hands on me. <laughs> All right. So we got a flying eagle. Yes, I love flying eagles. Take that all day. I, I thought that's better than a fatty Indian. That is, that's even better than a fatty Indian. Sweet. All right, flying eagle, yes. All right, now let's go get some silver. <laughs> I think I'm more excited than you are. Yeah. What, Am what? I'm more excited than you. I think maybe. I think I need more coffee. I got chai this morning instead of coffee and I think my energy level is just dropping rapidly. I got, I, you know, we're doing pretty good. Let's keep going. Okay, we've got another scent. It could be an Indian head. It could be a memorial. It could be a weedy. It could be a flying eagle. Let's see what it is. It's right here. I don't know. It looks kind of fat, doesn't it? <laughs> Wouldn't that be crazy if it was another flying eagle? Oh my god, I'd just die. I would, I would die, probably. Two in a row. That just doesn't happen. Oh, it's an Indian. An Indian? We're doing okay now. There we go. Now it's focusing a little. Got that thick rim. Sweet. An Indian and a flying eagle for the day. We're gonna keep going though. I know there's got to be more here. This is a one cent. There is no shield up there, so this is a one year type Indian 59. You can see the Indian, you can't see the date real well, but since there's no shield at the top, that means it's a 59. I decided to come around the back of the house and I just dug something pretty darn cool and I've dug it before but I've never dug a complete one. So check this out. <laughs> this is like darn near complete. It's got the innards even. This is a harmonica. At least it was a harmonica. A long time ago. <laughs> that is pretty cool. I could just imagine someone sitting on that step right there. You can see people have been coming in and out of that for a long time. Playing this harmonica right here. Must have fallen out of their pocket. That is pretty neat. That gave off a really good signal too. All right, let's keep going. Okay, well, I got a little hangry, so Andrew had to feed me, and we went to go eat. And we decided that since it's getting dark, now that it's daylight savings, we didn't really have time to go back and dig anymore today. So, decided to call it quits, but you know what? We're gonna be going back to that site because there's a lot more to get there. We've got a lot more property there, and we'll definitely be going back. Hundreds and hundreds, hundreds of, of acres. acres and I'm just happy with my flying eagle, so. It's my third one. You don't find those every day. No, they're tough. They're tough. So, all right, I think that pretty much sums it up. Right, Oliver? Right, kitty kitty? The cat's on a mission. I think he's ready for dinner. Are you ready for dinner? Weirdo cat. All right, we will catch you next time, later. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And whether you're looking for your first metal detector or you'd like to upgrade your current machine, we carry the full line of Garrett metal detectors. And I put a link to our website down in the description. Mule shoe, mule shoe, you're so sweet.